Before the video starts, make sure y'all go follow me on TikTok. It's that brother Joan. Link in the description. Go check it out. I got some funny vids. I already got two of them up. Go ahead and give it a like. What up, brother Jones here? And today we're gonna talk about the NBA 2K22 prelude demo. Now, there's a lot of little information about the demo or lack of demo, and we're gonna talk about it in this video. Now, first, Lord Pacino is a sub, so enjoy the video. Make sure you hit that sub button. Remember, you can always change your mind later. So let's talk about the demo first. Now, first, let's talk about what is 2K's purpose of demos. Now, it started in 2K17. 2K17 was the first demo experience, as in we had got a chance to make our mod player, make his face, we play some college, we can look at the animations, we can look at the contact dunk, we can look at a lot of stuff on the thing before the game came out, it got us real hype, got us real excited. 2K18, they did the same thing, similar thing, 19, 20, and 21. 20 and 21 they gave us a builder so we can just sit and make builds and estimate what builds we're going to make before the game even came out that's something we got to do in every single prelude so far now here's the thing this screenshot right here says that there may not be a demo there may not be a prelude for 2k22 now i'm gonna say this this is not 100 percent confirmed but I believe this. Now I'm gonna tell you why I believe it. Now I could be wrong. I could literally drop the demo tomorrow or the next day, right after this video. But this is this is why I feel like it might not. All right, so check this out. 2K20 and 2K21's demo were what? Exactly the same. Now, one reason, one theory why they might not drop it is because 22 current gen will be the same. It will have the exact same builder. There's a good chance, I'm telling you right now, there's a very good chance that current gen will have the same builder as 20 and 21. I, I really, this is what I believe. I don't think they changed current gen at all. I think you're going to get the exact same experience you got on 21. If you ask me, there are going to be other people that feel different. I feel like next gen is going to get the same builder, but very similar. But I feel like current gen ain't changing. They're not changing current gen. All their time had to be spent on next gen. They're not spending too much time on current. I feel like the only thing current gen gonna get is a new park and new gameplay. I feel like they'll give them a new park, new gameplay, better animations maybe, but as far as the build system, there's no way they're gonna just throw that away. I don't think they are. Next gen, I think they're gonna keep the same builder for next gen. So if they're, so think about it like this. If 22 current, has the exact same builder it's built the same from the fundamental base why would they give you the same demo three years in a row just so we can complain about it y'all know we gonna complain we gonna get if think about this let's say you open up 2k22 demo right you open it up bow it looks just like this again what are you gonna do y'all gonna be mad y'all gonna cause chaos y'all gonna be like y'all really gave us the same demo three years in a row is what y'all gonna say but tag a new logo on it that y'all really gonna give it the same thing three years in a row y'all gonna be hot that's one of the reasons i feel like they ain't gonna do it all right that's one of the reasons now here goes the effect of that if they don't drop a demo release day is gonna be chaos now when i what i mean by that we no. so we we're gonna go into 2k22 with absolutely no idea on how the builds are no idea how the bills actually i'll sub by the way because we gonna have the best bills we going ham i'm probably gonna stream bills galore that day i'm just gonna be streaming i ain't gonna even touch the park for a minute until i get a gauge of the bills because we normally get a week or two to look at the bills before the game come out but we getting the bills on the day of release well, we we're gonna be spending our time trying to figure out our player for a few days it's gonna be a completely different experience That's why i say it's gonna be chaos then we have two separate games dropping at the same time now in the comments let's say with next gen and current gen they're releasing the same day what do y'all want to see first current and next most of y'all are gonna say current i want to play next first to be honest to be honest i know current is gonna be the same current may be a step up from 21 because the speed glitch won't be in there but it'll be a new exploit it's a new exploit every year Y'all always find the exploit. Y'all find a way to break the game every single year. Y'all be the first one on the YouTube talking about, I broke the game. I broke the game. I made the build to break the game. Look at y'all. Y'all over like, oh, Joe, whoa, you do it too with the build. Silence! I don't know what you're talking about. 
But as far as we gonna have two games drop at the exact same time with no demo, we gonna on release day we're gonna be scratching our head looking at these two different builders depending on what game you play for it's gonna be the one of the most different it's the most different i don't know i don't, I don't know if i want to say the most it's it's one of the most unique scenarios that we've ever had on a release we have two different versions of 2k dropping what the hell but what do we pick first no demo we not gonna know what the hell we doing day one man Y'all don't know what build to make day one. That's why a lot of y'all ain't gonna pre-order. Because here's the thing, the demo raises the pre-orders. If y'all, a lot of people who are casuals that don't be on YouTube like that, see the demo, they download the demo and play on it, they wanna play some more. They wanna play some more my career. So they, I think the demo gives them more sales. So there's, here's also a chance that we will get a demo. Now if we get a demo, don't get, I expect the exact same thing. And then they have to drop two separate demos. Are they gonna drop just current? Or they have to make one for next two? This is why they might not do it. They also might not do it because they have to make two demos. One for next and one for current, unless they have the exact same builder, but it's already been proven that it's not the same game. It's probably different again. Community about to be split again. They have two separate teams on the bit on the uh, versions they have two separate teams they don't have the same teams on them so that lets you know right there i feel like current's gonna have the same wreck environment it's gonna have the same build system it's gonna have the same menus player panels animations next year's gonna get the upgrade this is my prediction look at me in the top right talk what are you talking about John, you ain't talking about nothing, bro. Look at dude in the top right talking. Anyway, we're currently getting everything the same except rep awards. That's also something they're going to change. There's no way they're going to give us the same rep awards. There's no way in hell. There's no way in hell. They're going to have Legend and all that. I feel they're keeping the system, but different rewards at Legend, etc. But they will not give us. They're not going to keep the same stuff. There's no way. But they will keep the build system. I'm pretty sure that it takes too much time for them to make too many new all that new stuff i don't think it's gonna they're gonna keep it next year gonna have the same build system current is gonna have the same build so this is just my prediction i could be completely wrong and i hope i am i hope i, am. I don't think scratch it all start from scratch again but history i mean think about this but 16 17's build system was very close 18 19 build system was very close 2021 system was close so they gonna next is gonna have a similar feel, you know what I'm saying? They gonna have a next is gonna have a similar feel of last year. The city's gonna be similar. They not throwing that city away. If you think they gonna throw all that away, <laughs> no, they're not throwing that away. Too much work was involved. All that, but in the comments right now, let me know how y'all feel about this. Do you feel? In the comments right now, do you feel? 2K should drop a demo. Or should not drop a demo which one do you feel and what are the effects of both if they drop a demo it will help us get a gauge of what we about to play if we don't get a demo it may be more exciting but we don't know what we're getting into at that point you know we don't get in the, we don't get park news to a day before the game drop so from now to september 8th 7th we not gonna know diddly squat about any builds or anything so we all gonna open this game both versions i'm literally gonna have 2k current gen on one screen next on the other screen i'm gonna have two monitors up and i'm literally gonna be playing both at the exact same time looking at both builds with eyes going the opposite directions of each because i gotta figure it out i gotta figure out what's going on but hopefully y'all enjoyed the video man leave a like sub me new mirror i said follow my tiktok we going crazy on there. Y'all going to see. I'm going to drop some funny stuff on there. To the next video. i see y'all there, man. Peace.